Hey, what is going on everyone? This is iReviews back with another video and today I will show you guys 20 plus hidden features of the new iOS 13 beta 5. Now this update was released yesterday by Apple and there are a ton of new features. Most of them are hidden. So here are 20 plus new features of iOS 13 beta 5. Starting with the App Store, when you go to your account on the App Store, you will have a new gesture to dismiss this page. Now normally you will have to tap done. If you just swipe down, it will only refresh the page. But if you do like an L gesture right here, you can go ahead and easily dismiss that page. Another change on the App Store here on the update section, if you have automatic updates enabled under the settings of the App Store, it will show you right here upcoming automatic updates right here at the updates of the apps that you have installed. When your device is connected to another device via Bluetooth and you're playing music on that device, you go to the music app on your iOS 13 device. Now it will show you right here the name of the device to which you're connected and to which you're playing music. On the Safari app, you can notice here the buttons at the bottom here and the download manager, everything right here is blue. That will change if you go to the private mode. Now on the private mode, as you can see right here, everything will be black. If you go from your camera app to your pictures right here to the last picture, you will see that you will have an edit button right here at the bottom and the all photos but button right there at the top. That will of course take you to all the pictures on your photos app. On the mail app on beta 5, you will find your drafts down here. If you tap right there, it will go to this kind of like tab view, just like you see the tabs on Safari. And here you will find all your drafts. There is also a change on the Memoji. We have a new hairstyle. So if you go to the Memoji, you will see this hairstyle right there is new. There is also a change on the health app. Instead of search, you will find here browse. So this has been changed. It used to be search. Now it's browse. Otherwise, everything here is still the same. iOS 13 beta 5 has brought a ton of changes on the volume hoods. Now on iOS 13 beta 5, you will be able to adjust the volume even if your device is on silent. Previously, you wasn't able to do that. Now on beta 5, as you can see, I put my device on silence and I can still adjust the ringer volume. 3D touching on one of the apps on the dock right here, it allows you to rearrange apps. So previously on the iPhone, I believe this was before on iPad, but on iPhone, this is new. You will also have the rearrange apps button on the apps that you have on the dock. The media controls on the control center also have been a bit redesigned. They are smaller. So the play and pause button and the next and the previous buttons are smaller now on beta 5 on the control center. The status bar icons have also been adjusted. Now you will see the cellular data icon is much bolder on beta 5. On iOS 13 beta 5, you will notice that the apps are now round. So you can see right here, if I just swipe the app, you can see it has round corners. And this also applies to the screenshot. So if I take a screenshot right here of the app within the app and I go to the screenshot, you can see right there, it has rounded corners. Another change right here on the markup tools. So you can see right here, if I select a color, it will show that color on the markup tool right there. Now the next time I come here, it will still show that color, which indicates the last color that you have used. This share sheet has also gone through a redesign on beta 5. All the labels here, the icons are black and they used to be all blue. Now you will find all black labels and icons on the share sheet. Also, if you scroll down right here, you won't find manage, but you will find edit actions right there. And a thing that I really, really love about the share sheet on beta five is that now you can have your favorite actions right there at the top. So if you just tap right there, tab done. When you go to the share sheet, you will have your favorites right there at the top. So you can easier access them from the share sheet. There are also some changes on the settings app. So now if you go to one of your apps right here on the settings, you will see that all the permissions will be right here in one place and you can easily enable or disable any of them directly from here. Going to settings, going to accessibility and then accessibility shortcut, you will find here dark appearance. This allows you to use accessibility shortcuts to enable the dark mode, which means that just press three times on the power button and you can easily enable or disable the dark mode. 
There is also a small change on the settings of the Photos app. You will find a button here to enable or disable the burst photos upload. There is also a change with the hotspot. So if you go to settings, you have to go to cellular and then right there you will find your personal hotspot. So that has been changed, has been moved right here into the cellular settings. So that is it for this video guys. These are some hidden features of iOS 13 beta 5. 20 plus hidden features of beta 5. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Go ahead and subscribe for more videos on iOS 13. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you on the next one.